good morning welcome to the channel Rick and I are probably on the last trip of the year we'll see how it goes here uh, it's supposed to get cold and windy here the next couple of days I think this is gonna be it we're gonna try a spot we've uh, fished maybe once before ever uh, didn't have the best of luck there but we're gonna try it again we're uh, chasing smallmouth bass see how we can do we uh, got a tip from a friend of the channel and uh, hopefully we can figure something out like I said uh, before and numerous times Rick and I are not uh, great at smallmouth but we're gonna give it a shot see how we can do thanks for joining don't forget to like and subscribe and we'll get started here in a minute Like a good one. Hmm? I can't tell. It doesn't really fight like a bass. It's a bass. It's a big smallie. Alright. Alright. Fish number one, 2.33, 2.33 for Rick on the Ned Rig. We've been fishing about 45 minutes. Don't know what we're doing. Finally uh, caught one. So not seeing a whole lot on the 360 either. Fishing some deeper rocks. Uh, hoping to stumble on some more. We caught one. <laughs> the skunk is out of the boat. Not even as big. Doesn't look as big. He's bigger though. I think he's bigger. Fish number two, it's a 2.29, 2.29 for Rick. Real pale looking fish. All right, that's two, three more, three more. Yeah, but I'm not used to missing. <laughs> That's only with the max scent worms. Uh, yeah, I yeah, get mostly. Not exclusively though. Switch to mine. He's not very big. They're all the two pounders. Oh, big. He's the biggest you've caught so far. 
I would say. I think so. Two and a half. Come on. We're Come close on. anyhow. Beauty. Beauty. Yeah, he's the biggest so far. Yeah. Alright. Mopping it up. Look at you. Kicking ass. Fish number uh, three for Rick on the Nedrig, 3.17, 3.17, nice fish. That's what we need, that's the ones we're looking for. Those and bigger, come on. Now I'm seeing that nice rock pile exactly out here, oh, to the left. The rock all yep. How's he feel? Decent? I think he's like his first fish. It's another three pounder, I would say. Or damn close. Probably bigger than that. It's a good one. Yeah. Very hot. Very hot. There's fish number four on the Ned Rig for Rick. It's a 2.88. 2.88. One more for our five fish bowl. One more. One more. A, on a fluke on a swim bait or the, on a heavier jig head. Color might be something. Minnow, minnow color. Yeah! Finally caught one. Here's my first fish. It's fish number five. That's goal number one. Uh, for our first five fish, uh, we also made goal number uh, two. So 13.60. 13.60. This is a 2.91. I missed like four or five baits. I, uh, bites. I was throwing a tube, and then I was throwing a like a like a grub on a on a jig head. Ended up switching to a kind of a heavy, heavy, almost like a Ned Rig head. And I just put on a Zoom Fluke, a small uh, Fluke style bait. Um, and I'm just throwing that out. I noticed that Rick is, you know, he's throwing his Ned Rig out and just kind of slowly letting it arc back in. So what I ended up doing is throwing this out and then I'm letting it land on the bottom and I'm lifting my rod up and, let, and then just clicking it in and reeling down, let it swing to the bottom and now that fish just, all of a sudden they're there, just there, you don't really feel them. I missed probably four bites earlier where the end of my worm would be gone or I'd try to set the hook and they'd just be there for a half a second and then be off. So hopefully figured something out here. Maybe I can catch another one. Catch up with Rick here. He's got four in the boat. I got one. But 13, over 13 for our first five. So we're feeling good. I like that minnow color. Yeah, the minnow color seems to be the ticket. There he is. Right below the boat. 
board again. Swing them in with this big jig head on. They're, they're too nice. I don't know if he'll call, but I think he's going to call that small one. There's call number one. It's on the swim, the jerk shad again. The zoom jerk shad on a jig head. 2.49, 2.49 takes up to 13.80, 13.80. Rick just had a small one that he released, wouldn't have called. So we're catching a few. open his mouth. Not bad. <laughs> I love it. Yeah, when, when we can actually figure it out. There's another nice call. We caught a few shorts up till now. This is what, fish number 11, I think, for the day. Uh, it's a 3.54, 3.54, that's big fish so far. That takes us to 15.01, 15.01. Awesome, here we go, buddy. Yeah. Man, that's, that's, that's fun. It felt like a wet sock in there. Right? Oh, this way. Yeah.
That's another good one. I think. Cast as far as you can out that way. I don't think so. He's digging pretty good. This one actually putting up a fight. Oh, a jig comes out of his mouth. <laughs> Hilarious. I don't think he's going to call even. No, I don't think he's going to call. No, he's not. He's got to beat two and a half. He's not. Just over two. Okay. Come on, Let's Get a big one. There's one. All right. All right. How's he feel? Ooh, he's digging good. He feels good. But they're they're easy to misjudge them because they uh, He's a they good fight one. so hard. He's a good one. There's one. <laughs> Let me know if you just bring him over here. I'll net him. In the net, Rick. Here. Big one, bigger than mine. <laughs> right, mine doesn't call. <laughs> this one call. Right, yeah, that's a four. That's a three. That might be big fish now. It's well over three. You make sure you show them in the camera real good. It's okay. It should. Yeah, he's a beauty. Look at that thing. If you want to show him up here, you can. You can show him. Oh, beauty. There's another good one for Rick. That's big fish for the day. That's a 3.88. 3.88. Takes up to 16.40. 16.40. Not bad, not bad. There's a fish. Little guy. I have to come up here and see if I can get my jig, okay? Yeah. He's not big? Well, now he's, now he's feeling a little bigger. Got a bad gill on him? Yep. Come on, cut it out. I didn't have it hooked in the gill. No, he, I think it's an old injury. It looks still looks healthy. Yeah. Just I, detached. I think it's an old injury. I think you'll you'll call. Oh yeah. There's an 
another nice call on the Ned Rig, a 3.59, 3.59. That takes us up to 17.10, 17.10. Awesome, we got one under three pounds. He's 2.9 something, so. <laughs> Ready? Here it comes. I don't see him. Holy oh, a nice one. He's gonna call out that little guy. Yes, he is. Yes! Come on, Eric. Let's get going. Let's get it going. Beauty. That's a three pounder for sure. Uh, he ain't, I mean, he's not three and a, three and a half or anything, I don't think. <laughs> 302, that's another call, 302. That's, everything's over three now. 17.21, 17.21. Moved, moved spots, found another little area that apparently has a few fish on it. Rick just lost one and I caught one. So we're gonna spend a little more time here. See if we can't get another one going. about this little bump on the front of this trough, I guess. Kind of know what to, kind of know what to look for. You know, anywhere there's a raised spot or, or a deep cut in the, a deeper spot in the river, there's going to be a current break in there. The aggressive ones will be on the front of it. But fish on. All right. And the other ones will be behind. Let me know if you need the net. Good one? I don't think he's particularly big. I don't think he'll call. I don't know. It's gotta be a three. Well, that's gonna call for sure. Huh? It's a three pounder. Close, I think. I think he's gonna call though. I think he'll call. It's heavy. It's the same as the one I just caught. Two, three, oh, two. It is. Same thing. Same exact. Probably the same fish. Two ninety nine. Three oh two. Same. Same size. It's all right. No call here, but same 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 size fish I we just caught 302. Well, that's gonna do it for Rick and I today on this uh, on this outing. Probably the last outing of the year. 17.21, not too bad. Made our main two goals and even our secondary goal of 15 pounds. So it felt like a pretty good uh, felt like a pretty good day. Probably caught around I don't know 25, maybe closer to 30 smallmouth bass today. Rick caught like three walleyes and, and a rock bass as well so he had the multi-species going real good so I want to thank Ron for giving us a heads up uh, 
he's a friend of the channel and uh, kind of let us know that fish were kind of going here, point us in the right direction and had a nice outing because of it. So we uh, really appreciate the, uh, the help on that. So uh, we're uh, wrapping her up for the season probably. Look forward to getting on the ice hopefully here and otherwise we'll get at it again next summer for the bassin. So we want to thank you so much for watching this year. Thanks so much for joining today. Don't forget to like and subscribe. And for Rick in the back, my name is Mark. This is Man on a Mission Fishing. We'll see you on the water next time.